Eddie Jones says Rugby Australia doesn't have the resources to implement the changes he'd hoped to make as Wallabies coach. Just weeks after the team's humiliating exit from the World Cup in France, Jones has quit his post with four years to run on his contract. Just under two weeks ago, Eddie Jones returned to the ground where he made his name to tell us he was going nowhere. What's changed? Uh, well, I did want to go on, mate, but it was, you know, commitments. Uh, coaching a team's a bit like being in a marriage, mate. You need commitment from both sides. And, you know, I was committed to change the team. Rugby Australia at the moment can't activate the resources, which are both financial and political, to get the change in place to make real change to Australian rugby. And the divorce comes with an acknowledgement of failure. I don't like to be in projects. I don't think that can really really um, get to where they need to get to. And, and, you know, I've made that decision. I don't think that's the case. You know, Rugby Australia probably doesn't think that. And that's where the unity of our, of our project is not in the place it needs to be, mate. Jones feels that he sacrificed himself for the Wallabies. Well, sometimes you go in the bank and you blow it up, mate, but you don't come out with the money. Um, <laughs> yeah, and, and, and that's, part, that's part of the deal. You know, as we said at the start, we're going to do a smash and grab. So we got the smash, we didn't get the grab though, mate. And when it comes to results, Eddie says it's on him. The only person you can you can look at in these circumstances is yourself. Did you do the job as well as you could? Well, I, I was 100% committed. And the only thing that's probably disappointed me is the media trying to create a situation where they're trying to make out I haven't been committed to the job. Let's be completely honest, I've got no job to go to. I've got no job offer. That's never been the case now. You can. You can run all those sort of stories and run whatever you want, but my commitment to Australian rugby has been absolutely 100%. In a month's time, we're going to be reading you as coach of Japan? Oh, I don't know, mate. Yeah, at, at the moment, I, as I said, I've got no offer. I've got, there's nothing, there's nothing in the horizon. I'm officially unemployed today. Can you categorically state there was never the Zoom meeting? That never happened? That was never part of why this has all happened? Well, I've never had a job offer from Japan, mate. Danny Weidler, Nine News.